God doesn't want you to go to him, though, just because of what he can do for you. That's why he came to the earth in the form of a man, a carpenter, who grew up poor, unknown. He doesn't want you to come to him because you're attracted to what he can offer you. He wants you to come to him because he wants you to know him. The fullness of his character. And the more time that you spend with God, the more you get to know his character. And let me tell you something. There is not anyone more beautiful than the Lord. There's not anyone more beautiful than the Lord. And, and his personality, like I said, is multifaceted. Like a diamond cut millions of times. Just when you think you know him, he shows you something else. God's got a great sense of humor. God loves to, he loves to laugh with you. He'll make you laugh. You'll just all of a sudden burst out laughing like you were back when you were eight and nine years old without a care in the world. And it will happen to you at a time when you have a lot of cares and a lot of worries and a lot of what ifs and how am I going to do this and where is it going to come from? And you can still have these joyful moments where he says, just rest in me. Worry about that later. Actually, don't worry about it at all. Cast your cares on me. Take take every single bit of what's rolling around in your mind right now. And you're trying to work out in your own strength, which is exhausting and, and never works. Take it all and say, God, I don't, I don't know how. I don't know when. I don't know who. It doesn't seem possible. But I'm believing you for it. So I'm going to I'm going to enter into your rest right now. I'm going to get in your presence. I'm going to enter into your rest. I'm going to thank you for it in advance because I know that you love to give good gifts to your children. And what a blessing it is. That the same people who mocked, spit at, ridiculed, blasphemed, slandered, his name hated him with everything in them. He invites you into his royal family. So the minute that you put.